And what is going on, everybody? I'm Sigli Toasty here, and today we are driving the RX-7 FC in FR Legends. This thing is already pretty modified, alright? It's got my signature little roof spoiler, right? I put it on every car. Uh, it is currently making 338 horsepower, so that's an upside. What we're going to do in this episode is put more power to it. 308, 338 just isn't enough. We need to spend some money. I just fully max it all out. Why not? Boom. I got the money. And I got the means to do it. So, fully upgraded the engine. Now let's go turbo kit. Oh, hey. Hoses all the way without spending gold? Alright. Well, I guess we're going to spend a lot of money. Alright. This thing makes 617 horsepower now. Ain't that magical. And look at it. Just looking all stock and stuff. So let's just put some rims on it. I know this video is already fast paced, but seeing how it's already eviction o'clock, I'm just gonna go I'm just gonna go real quick at it. Um let's go Nah, let's go full grey gunmetal wheels. Oh, that's gonna take all my money. Ah, let's not do that. Let's just go see how Let's just go see how garbage I am at drifting 600 horsepower RX-7. Right now it's just a, a basic warm-up lap, so I'm not trying my hardest right now, but I can already tell this thing's, this thing's going to be a pain in the A-double-S to drift, especially with the game being laggy. Alright, I smacked the bumper a little bit, ain't too bad. You know what, let's go pull the hood off of this thing real quick. And then pop the, pop the headlights up. Because that's just how I drive this car. Um, I don't know, how much for... Ah, I forgot, I don't like the mirrors on this, on this car. Whatever. Just gonna keep it basic. Just gonna keep it a little basic. I've been driving this course a lot lately, so let's see what I can do on it. Because the only way, because it's very technical, but you have to have like high horsepower to get any kind of points from it. As I say that, I smack it right into the wall. Let's try that again. Wow, already three minutes, and I'm already crashing this car, making 600 horsepower. I'm just going real quick at it. Even though the video still has to be over 10 minutes, hopefully over 15, I'm still, I'm still going fast with it. And there we go. Let's see how much points I made. How, yeah, 104.7. I think that's the most I've ever gotten on this, on this course, because I'm usually doing B. I don't know, this course and B, I'm really good at. The beginning part right here is a little hard for me, but once I get it correct, I've pretty much got the rest of the course down. As I say that, I miss all three checkpoints. So, I would say I gotta stop opening my mouth, but seeing how I don't have a face cam, and I'm recording this for YouTube, I can't quite do that. Let's go fix the rear bumper, because that's kind of bugging me. Alright, solo run, cor school course. Now let's go. Top horsepower RX7. What the rotary? I'm glad you can't LS swap it. Well, I guess if they did that, it would be, it would be kind of a good move. But I don't know. Never been a real fan of LS swap RX7s. And that's coming from someone who grew up with nothing but Chevrolets. I mean, I was dang near born in a Camaro. Yes, it didn't have the LS, but you know, it's whatever. Ooh, set 117.3. That's crazy. And by Camaro, I mean 78, not like 2002 or anything. Most things have LS. But, like, I, after being born, I was brought home in 78. My mom was driven to the hospital in 78. So. Yeah. Which, by the way, I might be getting my Taurus fixed soon. I might be getting my Taurus fixed soon. I might be getting. I might be getting some of the money. 
to fix it. And then I'll just have to find out how to make 500. So I got nowhere near that wall, but it's whatever. I still got bonus three for that little thing right there. Just hitting all the checkpoints. Ninety nine point eight. If I get closer to the wall, that would have been an easy hundred, maybe hundred and five, or at least a hundred. Come on, get closer. I said closer, not smack into it. But whatever. I'm gonna go hit B in a minute, just because I gotta fix the bumper. Just so I can show you how high horsepower this car is. Alright, pull off the whole bumper, whatever. Whatever, this is grassroots drifting. It's whatever. It don't matter. It don't matter. Just just for that, just for that fact, I'm probably gonna fix it with, uh, what do you call it? Uh, no, oh, no, I'm gotta fix it. I was gonna say fixing it with, uh, what do you, what are they called? The zip ties. There we go. I was about to start just wrapping them. The zip ties. You probably knew what I was talking about if you play this game. Enter at 129 miles per hour. I'm currently doing 81 sideways. I'm going completely sideways. Spinning tire. I'm going 90. No, don't stack into the wall. There we go. Absolutely no fixing right there. I just let whatever was going to happen, happen. 102.2. Let's do one more, and then I guess I'll go with track A, just to see how much uh, speed I can get on a somewhat straight track. I'm going to try to do as little fixing as possible. Just little, you know, like brake tap and emergency brake and like initiation. I'm going to try not to, uh -oh. as I say that, oh. You know what? Just take all the phones. Why not? And that was not sarcastic. Alright, it's only 5.4, whatever. I spent a lot of money on this in this episode alone. How much did yeah, okay, so the high horsepower two J Z or no one J Z makes six hundred and twenty-four at 8,050 RPM. This thing makes 617 at 9,500. That's insane. That's... That, that's... I don't even know how to describe it. So anyways, let's go hit A real quick since it's somewhat straight. Yeah, I do have to manji it, but it'll be better than having to take technical turns to show how much speed I can get. Alright, just watch the speedometer. I'm not gonna be able to I'm not gonna be able to tell you what speed it is. Uh oh, uh oh, run the wall. Alright, whatever. Run the fence. Why not? You know what? Let's go do something real quick. Instead of fixing the bumper every time, let's just fall on take it off. Let's just fall on take it off, why not? Front bumper too, why not? Why not take off the front bumper just for the uh nah, I like it better like this. I'll fix the front bumper. The rear bumper, this car looks good without a rear bumper. Not to mention, I put those big old exhaust tips, so. Look at that. Look at that. Ugh, I love how that looks. Solo run. Let's go back to the drift course. I'm still not good with IWD Speedway. I, I think that's Irwindale. I'm not good with it. I'm actually quite dog doo doos at it. But, you know, this is a new track that I'm good at. Nope, 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 nope. Alright, whatever, run the wall. Use the acceleration to spin it around. And there we go. What points do I get on that one? 115.5. Now 
And without the bumper, without the rear bumper, I don't have much damage. I might have a little damage to the quarter panel, but that's what I was. That was a little far, that was significantly farther than, than I expected it to be, but it's whatever. Again, I'm not doing this for points, I'm just doing this to drift, I'm just having fun. Hopefully you're enjoying the video as much as I'm enjoying making it. Be honest, dude, I just love drifting in this game. It's better than the... Uh, I enjoy this a lot more than the drag racing style game, uh, games like CSR and Blizzard Car Racer. Sorry if I'm stumbling on words a little bit, it's... I, I'm I'm sweating like a dog right now. I don't even think dogs sweat, so I don't get why that's a term. But, yeah, dogs don't sweat, they can't. Oh, I didn't even have to use the emergency brake on that one. Look at that. But yeah, I'm I'm sweating. It's it's oh. it's really hot in my room, and I can't have the window open because I live in San Bernardino. And if someone's not yelling outside, it's because police are outside, and everyone's just inside hiding from me. Not like hiding, hiding, but like they don't want to get involved. So that's just how San Bernardino is. If it's not about you, just leave it alone. You know what I mean? As long as it's not affecting you. Just leave it alone. Don't get in everyone's business. So, anyways, he's drifting. This was kind of a doggy doo run, but whatever. Oh gosh. 40.2? By the way, what's your favorite car in this game? What's, and what's your uh, most horsepower? Or what's your favorite build? It doesn't have to be the most horsepower. Like, you can have like a 200 horsepower S13 and like it better than your, I don't know, 600 horsepower JZX90. So what's your favorite build in this game, if you play this game, of course? If you don't play this game, then what's your favorite build of mine? The 600 horsepower S13? Uh, this thing, the 600 plus horsepower RX-7, the new IS-300, I don't remember how much horsepower is in that, but it's not much, or the Chaser, again, I don't remember the horsepower for that one. I'm gonna have to go look at it real quick. Alright, I'm gonna show you all my cars, that was a 117.4. Alright, so you got the 617 RX-7, 617 horsepower RX-7. You got the 624, S 624 horsepower S13. If you swap this motor back in, it's a 322 horsepower S13. So that could be your favorite build. You know, building the stock motor. The JCX 100 Chaser, making 315 horsepower. Or the IS300, making 348. What's your favorite build out of mine? If you Even if you play this game, what's your favorite build out of mine? Well, what, what, which one of them is the is your favorite? Because I'll make more videos on it if uh, you like it. Like if a lot of people say they like the JZX100 Chaser, I'll start making more videos in the JZX100. If a lot of people say the IS300, then I'll make IS300 videos. S13, I'll rebuild the KA18, or I'll just drift the uh, one JZ in it. And I totally messed up this one. Nope. Okay. Totally did not mean to do that. I'll just drift it around. Like in this video, I've done nothing but drift it after I bought, you know, all the upgrades in the first like two minutes of the video. Like it's currently 14 minutes into the video. And I finished the build within the first two. So if you're still watching up to this point, thank you so much. Um, yeah. If, if you just like the drifting, if you just like watching me drift, I'll drift whatever car you want, and I'll just drift it in a video. That makes an easy, I'm not, it's not like I want to make easy videos, but like, it's just a video I can get out that you'll enjoy. Instead of having to create like a whole list on a build for the Pixel Car Racer, or spend a lot of money on a car like I did today, if you just want to watch me drift, I'll drift for 15, 20 minutes. I'll do it, I don't care. Again, I love drifting in this game. I love this game. This game, ever since it came out on Android, I just can't seem to put it down. 
Even if it's slow right now, I'm still playing it. And it's, I love it. So, if you want to see me just drift, tell me down in the comment section. If that's what you're into, if that's what you want to see, I'll make more videos, trust me. Tell me down in the comment section what you want to see in a video. I'll make it. And trust me, even if, even if it's for a game I can't seem to play yet on my phone, if it's for a game that I can't play yet, once I get the phone, that'll be able to play that game. I'll play it and make that video you wanted. Alright? I have lists of videos I have to make. I'll add your video to a list. A separate list of videos that I can't make yet, but I want to make. But I'll make your video. Trust me, I will. If you guys want to see a video, just tell me down in the comment section. Again, you're the people who watch my videos. So without you, I get no views. And without, without views, there's no chance of me, you know, making this into a full thing. And, you know, being able to do this for you guys. I, I want to I wanna entertain you. I want to make videos that you want to watch. So, if there's a video you want to watch, tell me down in the comment section. And not to mention, once I get editing software, a better laptop, and a camera, or just a phone with a good camera, I'll start making, like, card videos and vlogs and stuff. I have a, I have a Taurus. Alright, so I'll, t I'll show you how to build a car that's not supposed to be built. Like, you see everyone building Supras, RX-7s, Miatas, but then you got, like, these, you know, different builds. Like, you got Gingium's B2200 with a 1JZ in it. You got... You got Rob Dom putting a rotary in a Corvette. You got these different builds that people like to see. So if you want to see me build a Taurus into something that'll whoop A, then, you know, I'll make it. Well, I mean, I'm gonna make those videos anyways, but if there's, like, a specific mod you want to see, I'll consider it. Like, if you want me to make my own, like, front bumper or something, I'll figure out how to do it. I mean, I've always wanted to make front bumpers and everything, but, like, do what Dan just built his own bump front bumper for his truck. So, anything possible. And, by the way, after this race, I'm just gonna stop ranting, and I'm just gonna end the video. This is just, uh... I mean, not a filler video, but, like, this is just a video that I enjoyed making. I mean, d don't get me wrong, I enjoy making all my videos. But it's not, like, one where I have to worry about, like, building a specific car. I was just drifting. I was just putting all the horsepower I can into this car, and I was just drifting the whole time and talking to you. I, I enjoy make I, I love making these types of videos. And if you want to watch them, I'll make more. Since I can't seem to find someone to do a podcast with me, this is my only way of doing it without sounding like weirdo because i'm talking to something for instead of like 18 minutes it's an hour anyways rant over i'm ending the video here if you like the video leave a like if you dislike the video leave a dislike tell me down in the comment section why you like to dislike the video talk to me down in the comment section i love when people give supportive and positive comments and i'll never do anything negative towards a negative and unsupportive comment that's quite mean i'm all about spitting positivity so Go do something positive for someone. I mean, I don't have to be telling you to do that, but, you know, it's whatever. Hit that subscribe button, hit the bell icon to be notified when I post videos. I post every other day, but not at a set time, so that's what you're going to need the bell icon for. Um, my social media is down in the description. Instagram number one is for myself and for, my, and for the channel, so if you want to keep up with me and the channel, go follow that. If you like cars, trucks, motorcycles, there's Instagram number two for you. You'll find something that you like. And hopefully if you like a lot of the content, then you'll hit that blue follow button, because that's always good too. Uh, I'm starting to get better at Twitter, so go check that out. It's also in the description. And I hope you liked the video, and thanks for watching.